Hi everyone, welcome to part 3 of Let's Play Star Wars Battlefront. For this one, we're going to be doing Aggressive Negotiations, which takes place on the Wookiee planet of Kashi. We are still playing as the CIS, and uh, we'll be taking the battle to the Wookiees. So that'll be interesting, new enemy. Not really very varied, though. Um, we got our first Jedi bonus for once, and Count Dooku is going to be playing by our side, and we're finally going to get Super Battle Droids, which, I mean, they're not that different from uh, the Assault Droids that we're already using for our Soldier class, but they do have rockets on uh, on their wrists, which is a lot of fun for crowd control, and if you want to make your enemies go flying in an awesome explosion of death, that's pretty fun. Um, what I usually do is I take George Starfighter and I kind of strafe the Wookiees for a bit. Um, this is, I don't really like this map too much. It's kind of just the big kind of clusterfuck in the middle. There's not really a lot of strategy involved. Um, because, I mean, if you're, if you're the Wookiee side, you're just kind of stuck in the middle unless you flank the outlying command posts, which can be kind of tricky to do. And then for us, it kind of sucks for the droids because we have to cross a lot of water and you don't want to spawn as a droidica and then cross the water because your health will start to take damage and eventually you will die. Um, you maybe think that because you're in a droidica you can just, you know, cross the water really quickly and not take that much damage. No, your health will diminish really, really quickly and you will get wet and you will die. As futuristic as these droids are, they apparently cannot deal with water damage. They don't really have bags of rice available for the CIS. That's a bad joke, I know. Um, so yeah. So, once I get tired of strafing Wookiees, I'll try to take one of their command posts. I like to take this one right here. It's not really hard to do, because there's only really one entrance, and you can use these windows to kind of pick off Wookiees if you want. Um, Okay, so you have your regular kind of blaster that you already have with the other assault class droids. Um, you also have secondary shot, which is kind of like a little shotgun thing. I don't really like to use it. It's really slow and takes a lot of reload. As you can see, it runs on a little meter at the top of your screen. Um, it's not really very effective. If you are reloading with this blaster, you should just use your rockets because. That's a lot more fun, and it's a lot more effective for crowd control. Destroyed my fighter. Well, even though that's technically also a droid, however. Alright, well, they took one of ours, we took one of theirs. Uh, try to hold these middle command posts, because... Really, that's the best way to win, since so their main command post is so right here. Eventually, your numbers will just over, uh, overwhelm there. So just count Dooku doing some work. Count some Wookiees. This isn't really a hard mission, I mean, it's pretty straightforward. Just kind of come from the side, come from your side command post, go through the middle, capture the middle command post. That's pretty much done with. Wookiees take a lot of the hits from, from our sides, because they're pretty much flanked on all sides. And then once you capture more command posts than they do, and they start bleeding out, it's pretty much over. So, yeah. Sorry this part's coming a little late to uh, any of you who are actually watching these. Um, a few of you, I greatly appreciate it. <laughs> um, since it's still my very first gameplay walkthrough, kind of. Let's play ever. So thank you for being patient with me. Um, I couldn't upload any last semester because last semester was really, really hectic for me. It was a pretty tough semester, so I was busy a lot, and a whole bunch of new games came out like Halo and Dishonored and a lot of Mass Effect DLC. So I was pretty busy with you know a lot of stuff, and you know kind of have to get sleep sometimes. So I'm I'm glad I'm getting back to it though. Uh, so, I'm capturing this one. So yeah, that little 
rocket launcher is a lot of fun to use. Um, this game is still using Pandemic's engine, and they had some pretty cool uh, ragdoll physics back in the day when they were big, before they closed down, got some things coming down. You will be missed. Would really kill for a Battlefront 3. I prefer a Knight's Grill to Public 3 because, as you can see by my YouTube username and my gamer tag, Darth Revan, um, I'm a really big Knight's nice Grill to Public fan. So, I prefer a Knight's Grill to Public 3, but Battlefront 3 would be a lot of fun too. But, you know, neither of them will probably happen, so. I just have to wait and see and hope Star Wars 1313 is good. Which, I mean, it looks promising so far. I really like being charged games, so. It's like Star Wars, it's kind of like a more mature story and, you know, good gameplay, then I'll, I'll be all over it. And also, it'd be fun to kind of revisit the original trilogy timeline. Kind of see what things were like on Coruscant during the Reign of the Empire, since we never really saw Coruscant um, during the Galactic Civil War in the movies. It'd be kind of interesting to see. So, yeah, I mean, as you can see by our our numbers, they're pretty much done for. Um, what happens at this point is they'll usually try to go for one of our outlying command posts, like they're doing there. Um, that can be a little annoying, it prolongs the battle a little bit, and I mean, you can see we're doing the same there, so it just kind of prolongs the battle a little bit, but it's pretty much over, so you can just mess around, I guess. Let's see if we can take these guys. I guess I can show you how quickly Droidicas die in water. If we can get there in time. Uh, I guess. Oh. The river's on the other side. Never mind. This one's not the one that's the river. It's been a while. Sorry, guys. So, yeah. We have victory. That was pretty straightforward. Um. So, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Um. I hope you enjoyed. Sorry for my newishness when it comes to walkthroughs, but I'm trying. Uh, thanks for all you, your support, whoever is actually watching. Um, stay tuned, because I'll try to do more. I'll, I'll definitely finish my Battlefront playthrough, and then um, I'm still undecided as to what game I'll play next, but if you guys, whoever actually watches me, if any of you have any suggestions, then feel free to let me know what they are, because I'll definitely take them. Then next time we'll be doing the Battle of Genosis, and that one's always fun. So, see you later. Thanks for watching.